Okay, number one, remember it's going to multiply each one of these exponents by this exponent right here. So that's going to be 6 to the 2 times 1, that's 2, and y to the 2 times 2, that's 4. 6 squared, that is 6 times 6 is 36, and y to the 4th. On number 2, zoom in a little bit more, on number 2, that's going to be 2 to the negative 3 power, because that's like a 1 right there. Then we have x to the negative 3 times 4, that's negative 12. And all these are negative, so you have to cross the bar. So I want to cross the bar. So that's going to leave me with 2 to the 3rd on the bottom, x to the 12 on the bottom, and a 1 up on top. 2 to the 3rd, that's 2 times 2 times 2, that's 8. x to the 12, and a 1. On number 3, that's going to be x to the 2 times 5, that's 10. x to the 3 times 2, that's 6. And that equals x to the, add the exponents, 10 and 6 is 16. Okay, number 4. That's going to be 2 to the, remember that's a, one, that's a 1 on each one of these. So that's going to be 2 to the 3 times 1, x to the 3 times 1, and y to the 3 times 1. Then I have x, 2 times 2, that's 4. Okay, that gives me 2 to the 3rd. And then look at my x's here, I have x to the 3 and 4. These two together, 3 and 4, that's 7. And y to the 3rd. 2 to the 3rd is 8. Then I have x to the 7th and y to the third. Okay, number five. I wanna... No, be quiet please. Thank you. All right, that's a to the negative two times three, that's negative six. a to the negative four. Okay, so now we add our exponents. Six, negative 6 and negative 4 is negative 10. You can't leave a negative, so we cross the bar. And that's a to the 10th. 1 over a to the 10th. Okay, number 6. Uh, let's see, that's 3 squared b to the negative 2, negative 2 times 2 is negative 4. Then I have an a to the 2 times 3, that's 6. Then I have a b to the 4 times 3, that's 12. Oops, too much there. Okay, so now I 3 squared, 3 times 3, that's 9. Then I have a to the 6 put them in alphabetical order, and then I have a b to the negative 4 and negative 12. Negative 4, I'm sorry, negative, negative 4 and positive 12. 12 minus 4 is 8. Number 7. Okay, we have 2 to the negative 4 power, negative 4 times each one of these in here. 2 to the negative 4. Then we have a, negative 4 times 2 is negative 8. c, negative 4 times 4 is negative 16. Then I have my other power here. That's going to be a 
so it's times. 8 is 7 times 2, that's 14. And I have C to the negative 1 times 2 is negative 2. Okay, so let's see, 2 to the negative 4. Hey, all that's got to go down, well, that's got to go down below. Okay, so that's going to go down below. That's 2 to the 4th down in the bottom. And let me com combine my a's first. I have a to the negative 8 and 14. 14 minus 8. 14 minus 8 is a to the 6. So that stays up on top. And then I have c to the minus 16 and minus 8 and minus 2. Minus 16 and minus 2 makes c to the minus 18. Okay, that's negative 18. You have to bring that down. So I'm going to have a to the 6 on top. On the bottom, 2 to the 4th. That's 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. That is... 16. Then to see the negative 18, that must go down below to make it positive. Number 8. Okay, let's see. This is all raised to a power 3 to the positive 3. Then I have a, 4 times 3, that's 12. Then I have a b, b times, let's see, negative 3 times 3, that's negative 9. Then I have my, for my a, I have 2 times negative 1. For the b, I have negative 2 times negative 1, that's positive 2. So we're done multiplying the exponents, now we simply add the exponents. So we have 3 to the third, that's 27. A's, I have a to the 12 minus 2, that's 10. For the b's, negative uh, 9 and 2. Negative 9 plus 2. That's negative 7. Okay, we have a negative in there, so that's got to go down below. So our total answer is 27. A to the 10th. All over. B to the 7th. Okay, last one. Okay, start off with our A. Multiply the exponents. 3 times negative 2. Then the B. 4 times negative 2. Then I do my A over here. Negative 3 times negative 4 is positive 12. Matthew, be quiet please. Then I have a B, negative 5 times negative 4 is positive 20. Alright, so now I do my A's. Let's see, I have a negative 6 and a 12. 12 minus 6. Then I have my B's. Minus 8 and 20. 20 minus 8. And that is my answer.